guys, it's been a while, but I thought I'd do another little video for you. Uh, here you can see on the desk, I've got my SV06 Plus sitting here, and it's got my um, my own screen and Raspberry Pi uh, mount with uh, my own install of Clipper on there. Uh, and that's running alongside um, my, my uh, upgraded mainboard mod uh, for the SKR3 EZ, uh, also has um, my Vortex uh, coin and duct system with LED light bar um, and also a community based um, power supply mod that has a quieter fan on there, a larger and quieter fan which is very handy but today uh, there's this kind of innocuous little black box sitting on the frame and um, what this little guy is is a um, power relay uh, adapter thing which can shut the, the printer completely down once the print has finished and the printer has cooled itself off um, and it's all fully controllable within Clipper and Moonraker and with macros and all kinds of fancy stuff so um, and what you can do is um, say if you you've got a print running at the moment um, but it's going to finish at silly o'clock in the morning you can just flick this little switch and this will let the printer know that you want it to turn itself off after it's cooled down and uh, completed what it's doing rather than sitting there running away idle all night using power and god knows what um, so that's awesome and what, what you can also do is you can go up here to the Moonraker menu and you can see we have power devices so we have two here one for a reset and one for uh, a remain on thing so if we just click that off and after a short time you'll see the power for the MCU and the, the motors and lights and things be shut down by itself the the pie will still remain on but it will give you an error message saying clipper is shut down so oh, there you go there's a little click any second yeah you see the lights fade off and uh, in a second we'll realize yep there we go clipper has shut down there we go um, so that's basically what it'll do once you finish your print it will turn the the printer off the power plug uh, switch is still on but the relay is controlling the mains power so it is cut completely so there is absolutely no power to this at all it's all completely off um, and what you can do is you can go into the menu and go to the power thing and turn those on um, but it's it's a few clicks it's not a lot of hassle but it's a few clicks and the same the same with the the screen you can go back up to the top there and go to the power menu but me being me uh, as some of you may know um, i've added a little sneaky bonus around the back uh, <laughs> a little power switch uh, which brings everything all back on by itself restarts clipper powers the printer all back up with a single button push so that is absolutely awesome and what else what else yes this what else this little thing can do um, it has a, another little wire that runs across to the MCU and is connected up to uh, the circuit there um, and that will detect if you ever have a short circuit on a thermistor or a heater or any of the circuit that's the circuits that are in the main board or the printer it instantly detects that short circuit and kills the power to the printer um, hopefully stopping any kind of fire or damage or you know anything worse happening basically so it, it, it's a safeguard it's it's a very handy thing to have um, and it can it can do so much you know it, it's a fantastic addition to the printer uh, it's a little bit of work to get it going but i think personally it's really worth it because you know you have that peace of mind for safety and you can have it turn itself off after a print so you don't have to go right well i've got to stay up till two in the morning waiting for this or you know leave it running all night etc etc and i hear you guys asking well so how do i go about doing that well i've put it all on github for you <laughs> basically you know it's all it's all here everything you need all the links all the copy paste commands to make sure your gpio pins are held high at boot so it stays on and and you know kind of all the code to put into into the moonraker file not the macros not the printer cfg but the actual moonraker uh, file uh, so this is the higher level file above clipper 
So, you know, you, you put stuff in here, this will run, if the Pi's on and, it's, and moon, moon Rake is running, this, this will work. So even, that's why I was able to turn it, turn it back on, even though Clipper was, was in shutdown, because it was running Moonraker, running in Moonraker. Uh, so it was, it was the higher level kind of stuff. Um, so that's really cool, and there's a nice big warning there, don't play with mains electricity, it's dangerous. Um, but yeah, it's, it's kind of, uh, it's true. But yeah, it's all, it's all on GitHub, um, and you can go through the file, copy and paste all the stuff in there. And yeah, so there's, there's all that, and you too can have a, a, an awesome machine uh, that turns itself off when it's cooled down and finished printing. And uh, yeah, you can't beat that. Thanks for watching.